The fiery scene just after 3 o'clock this afternoon on I-75 near Naples, Florida, after a small private jet is crashed onto the highway in the middle of the afternoon rush, hitting a vehicle on the interstate. Two people were killed in the crash. Now, the crash happened after the pilot declared an emergency, reporting both engines had failed. The plane was just seconds away from landing. Authorities say five people were on board the plane. Three people did survive, but right now it's unknown if they were hurt. Flight records show the plane took off from Columbus, Ohio, and was scheduled for the Naples airport when it went down. The barrier wall had a hole in it, was charred from, from fire and smoke. As I passed by the crash, I could feel the heat from it as I was driving by from the opposite side of the highway. Bro. It seemed pretty catastrophic, pretty intense. Those lanes of I-75 there in the Naples area are still shut down tonight as the investigation gets underway. The NTSB is looking to what may have caused those engines to fail.